This summer, we've seen massive flooding on Metro Detroit roads just a few weeks ago. Actually shut down several major highways, damaging cars, causing headaches for drivers. Well, tonight's 7 Action News traffic reporter Anne-Marie Laflame investigates what's being done to fix the problem and how MDOT says you can help. Trash on our roads. We've all seen it. Maybe you're responsible for throwing garbage out your window. We all know it's wrong, but beyond aesthetics, trash on our roads is causing a bigger problem than you might think. We've seen, you know, anything that you can imagine that would end up in a regular garbage can ends up on the freeways. We've seen pizza boxes on the side of the road. Yeah, you name it. Shoes, car mufflers, I mean, anything. All clogging up these multi-million dollar pump stations, working to get the water off our roads. The pump station is used to pick the water up from the catch basins that are in the low point and then pump the water back to street level so it can get into the local storm sewer system. The pump station here off Southfield Road in Allen Park pumps water from the low level road under the railroad tracks. It just got a million dollar renovation. There are stations just like this across Metro Detroit, but still this was the scene last month when heavy rains brought massive flooding, shutting down several major highways. The pump houses in that area were working just fine. Uh, we, you know, the Wayne County forces responded to the area and found that a lot of the inlets, the catch basin inlets, were clogged with debris. Uh, so it was a function of, of cleaning that up and then everything everything drained. There are maintenance crews out working to pick up the trash on the roads, but MDOT says they need your help before it gets worse. One of the big issues that we have, especially in, in, the, in the metro area, in our urban area, is these low points in the roadway are low points for miles and miles around. So a lot of the litter and garbage ends up making its way to these low points, uh, clogs up the catch basins, it ends up getting into the pump house. We do have trash racks that try to filter that stuff out from actually getting sucked up into the pump because that would damage the pump. A simple fix, make sure your trash ends up in the garbage. I'm Anne-Marie Laflame, 7 Action News.